Oh, look at him. Look at the adorable wee little buggers. I can't believe you guys managed to wiggle your way back into the zoo. Oh, but I'm happy to have you back. Look at how cute they are and look at the space they've got. I hope it's enough space. Is this enough space? They've got their toys. They've got a little bit of melon to eat here. Check out their new little houses. Isn't this just the most adorable thing in the world? Look at that little thing. They can just hide in there and stay in there and hopefully there's enough room to lay their eggs and mushrooms. Check out these mushrooms. Aren't they so cool? Oh, I love it. I love all of it. Hopefully they like it too. You guys have your insects to eat here. You've got your toy. Are you going to play with your bone? Do you want to pick up your bone? No? Do you want to eat some insects? Some yummy- <gasps> Spring! Spring! How the heck did you get yourself beached on land? Dolphins don't belong on land. Goodness gracious, don't scare me like that. Good grief, Spring. Ah, <sighs> anyway, we better check on everybody. Oh, look at all the people that are starting to show up over here, intern. This is fantastic. This is exactly- <gasps> Look at her backpack. That's a whale shark backpack. That is so cool. And actually, that reminds me. We definitely need to put- Oh, look at her. Are you happy, ma'am? How's our pilot whales? Are you guys mating? Oh my gosh, I think they're mating. Let's investigate. Swimming with lady. Yeah, yeah. Swimming with knight. Not pregnant. Maybe thinking about it, is she is she younger than him or is he just always going to be bigger than her? Hmm. I have to remember that. We won't get to keep her if she doesn't get pregnant and have a calf. Well, alright, we'll keep an eye on them. Let's see. Water filter, water filter. Oh, it has been so busy, so busy in turn. But I'm very excited about all the changes that we have had. We definitely need to add the cover to this area. I think we should be able to work that just fine. And there's some very, very- oh, Look, he's got his face painted! Oh, that's awesome! I'm glad to know the face paint kiosk is going well. She has her face painted too! Oh, that is just so cool. Yeah, there's like nothing for people to buy over here. We're definitely gonna have to set up like a little, little area. Oh, are you guys happy? Are you so happy? I'm happy you're happy. Good job, guys. We'll have to set up some shops, some things for people to buy. Because, oh, she's got her face painted too. Jeez, that face painting kiosk must have taken off when I turned my back. How's it doing? 18 people in a year. Not exactly a roaring success, but, but I wouldn't call it terrible either. All right, let's see. <gasps> you know what we need to replace? My dolphin arches. Dolphin arches, dolphin arches. Right here? What are these? Oh, the binoculars! No, but we might think about those. You know what? This underwater lamp would probably be really cool when we get this area covered. And we can just put the underwater lamp all along here for everybody. That would probably be pretty awesome. What else do we have here? Hmm. These statues and things. What I think we're going to do is we're going to come over here, like I said, and we're going to turn this into like little coastal island areas so that the coastal island animals, uh, kind of like the river dolphin, uh, not quite, let's see, nope, we don't want you, a panda, <gasps> oh, if only, this is not that type of zoo though, so we're going to have to decline the panda, now is not the time for pygmy hippopotamus either. The rock hopper penguins. Hmm, and emperor penguins. I think we do need to add some more rock hopper penguins to keep the population going, but we'll get to that in a second. Trying to save our money for some things. Nope, can't get pandas. Not you, not you, not you. We'll work on that in just a little bit. We'll work on that in just a little bit. In fact, I think because we've been five stars so long, I think that pretty soon I might get permission to have any animal I want, any time I want. Because we have been five stars for a very long time. And in my personal opinion, that should uh, earn a little bit of fame by now. So this is the marine statue. What does it look like? 
I can't really get a good idea of what it looks like. Let's sink some uh, research into that. Because we're getting to the point where we want to start decorating a little bit more. Paradise arch? No. There we go. My dolphin arches. Ah, there we go. That's what we need. We need to put these back down. Boom, boom. There's a kid in the way. I don't want to smush the kid. Are you watching the show? You're getting kind of hungry. Why don't you come over here and think about eating instead? Oh, he's going to the marine gift cart. Good kid. Alright, where was I? Ah, there we go. Boom. That's better. Alright, good, good. See, this is this is more looking looking like what we need. Also, I think some benches around here would be a good idea. Maybe a bench here. Bench here. We could add a bench, like, right where that dude's standing, and people can sit down, and they can look. I'm thinking we might add the Emperor Penguins after all. What do you mean, guests can't find donation boxes? I have them scattered everywhere. Except, you know, that down this giant... Hmm. Hmm. Whoa! There's so many people here! Why are there unhappy people here? They're really crowding around. Oh my gosh, she's so unhappy! She has to pee, and she has to eat. I think we're going to have to take care of this in turn. Definitely, definitely, definitely. Also, what is this? We have a bunch of broken piles of, of panels and things down here. What is going on? This have, must have happened when we had our earthquake. And I just didn't think to look over here. Alright, let's, let's get down here and fix this. Alright. There we go. Almost done. There's that. And let's get the wooden fencing put back in. Oops. Alright, hammer and nails in turn. Hammer and nails. We've got this. You and I are a team. We've been working at this for so long. We know how to get the job done. There we go. Holy moly! All these people are waiting in line at the gift cart? Oh man! If we have two gift carts, will, will that help? I mean, demand is through the roof right here. We can always move that gift cart in just a minute, too. But yeah, people up top are hungry and tired and unhappy. And there's a lot of people right here. Jeez. Maybe if we got more donation boxes. I think, I think I'll tuck another one right here. It's probably too close, but... And put one over here. There we go. Jeez, that's like every few steps, but whatever helps. How many donation boxes? Or how much? Oh my gosh, almost 800 donators. Or donors right here. Wow, that's a lot of money in donations too. Alright, let's see. Well, we're definitely going to need to provide some benches for the people up top. Because we've got some very unhappy people. And I think it's because they're hungry. So actually... I think we should provide food. Food in the form... It's not a restaurant. The restaurants would be preferred, but that's okay. Um... Ooh! And we should put the aquariums! Like the jellyfish aquarium in here! Oh, that would be so cool! Oh, I can't wait to see that in there, but first things first. Let's see. Let's feed everybody. So let's get everybody some food. That's the hot dog stand. The shish kebab. Sub food. Ooh, the pineapple seafood stand. Where they sell pineapple. Man, that would be kind of cool, but I think we'll save that for the little, the little island spot. Let's see. Sushi. Salad. Everyone likes different things. That's the thing, too. Maybe we should just play it safe and go with a generic drink stand. And a generic dessert stand. And a generic food stand. That's so bland though. I mean, we should, we should go with a sugarcane stand. That's exciting. But I think we'll have the themed foods elsewhere. I think over here... Let's see... Where is... Just our generic food stand. There it is. 
I think what we'll do is we'll do a little a little snack spot. So let's make a little snack hot spot right here. In fact, let's do this. And we'll put them right here for people to shop at. A little generic snack spot. And drink spot, because people, once they get up here, they kind of want to be pampered a little bit and not have to to be so stressed about finding somewhere to sit and whatnot. So let's see what else. Ooh, look at that paradise fountain. That's gorgeous. I can't wait to have that in here too. Let's see. Also, what was that? Nautilus drinking fountain. Let's put some research into that too. And because we should start putting drinking fountains up and about. Music rock. I bet a music rock would really cheer everybody up. We have just our general, let's see, underwater. Paradise music rock might work. Generic music rock, safari music rock, tundra music rock. Let's go with our underwater music rock, considering the content of where we are. Um, would that fit? Would that fit? That's the question. I don't think it would fit. Because it's more important. Well, people can still walk by right there. Hmm, we can always move it. We can always move it. So don't don't worry too much about it in turn. Let's see. All right, let's go back over here. Where are? Ha ha! That's what I was looking for. Our tables. Let's go with these ones, the coral tables and things like that, just to make a nice little like accented area. All right, and you guys are kind of in the way of where I want to put a table. Right there. And then we need to very carefully put down, let's see, somewhere to recycle your stuff. I'm gonna tuck that right over here, actually, because it'll fit perfectly. And somewhere to throw your stuff away. That little kid is perfectly in, wow, look at that name. Paulo Sergio da Silvia Lee. That is an impressive name, young sir. I like it. It's long, like my name. Let's see. And then... The underwater trash can? Oh. We're so doing that instead. There we go. Underwater donation box? Oh, we should have done those instead. That's okay. Instead of these. Donation box 18. We'll put right there. The music rock. We could probably move over here. Where'd you go, music rock? We'll move it over here for now. And then this area looks kind of weird. So even though this is kind of an interesting move on my part in turn, bear with me for a second. I kind of want to put some plants up here. Let's see, not the African violets. Oh, the basket fern! We could always hang basket ferns from things. See, we could hang the basket fern from the lighthouse. I won't do it right now, but we could. I'm just saying. It'd be cool that people have against putting plants in places that plants normally don't belong. All right, let's see. That's more what I'm looking for. I like these little flower beds and things. No, no room, no room. That's okay. That's okay. I think what we'll do... There are some, those are banana trees. This is a cabbage tree. California palm fan. I think what we'll do... Um, where's our... Let's use these, these tree ferns that we've been putting all around the zoo. I just want to make this look a little nicer. There we go. So that when people are staring at this huge wall area, it's not quite, quite as dull to look at. There, man. Do we ever have an amazing zoo? I am so proud of our zoo. I love it. Let's see. And then we'll fill that in as time goes on. But I think people are going to be very happy to actually have somewhere that they can eat and somewhere they can drink. Oh, and you know what they need after that, in turn? After you have something to eat and something to drink, 
there's another place that you need to visit. Let's see. Let's see. What is that? Staff center, huh? Well, none of our staff ever have time to have time off. So we don't need to worry about that. There we go. You know, they actually have an underwater themed bathroom area. But I think we're okay with just our generic little huts that we've been using. We'll go ahead and stick that right here. I can't see. Let's see. Did I put Java ferns there? I did put Java ferns there. That's okay. We can move them. Scoot you over and scoot you over. Think about that. Boom. And now everybody has somewhere to use the bathroom. Oh, look, people are already lining up for food and drink. There we go. So people like having a little bit of room to rest and eat. That should go over well. That should go over very well. I think that was a smart move in turn. Good job. Now what about here? I think we're going to move this marine gift cart because it's kind of silly to have two side by side. And that one's been making quite a bit of money. So I think we'll come back in just a bit. Can I take this out? There we go. And I don't think we need... Oh, what's your problem, young young miss? Why are you unhappy? Winter is chasing a sea turtle. Yeah, she does that. She does that. All right, we'll leave that there because it's already collecting donations. That's much better. Now that's another thing I was thinking about though, is that we're still, whoa, look at all these people. Man, they're happy to have somewhere to eat and drink and stuff like that. I wonder if we should just put in some of the generic, oh, the, the research for the drinking fountain is done. We could be nice if people want to drink and we can just like offer them like, here, have a free drink. Oh, why are you unhappy, ma'am? See, you're going to use the restroom, and guess what? It's available. Currently like occupied by two people. Ah, oh, there. All right, let's get down here and check this out. Also, it looks like, you know what? While we have the time. Also, Keeper Martin, why can't you? Okay, I will admit that piece of bird poop is quite embedded. So I will under have be like understanding about not being able to reach that one. Also, water filter 22 is clean. Why is my- why are my belugas hungry? Where are my zookeepers? Don't I have a zookeeper? I think I need a new zookeeper. I think I have too many. Alright. Zookeeper Wang. You are assigned to the turtles, the belugas, and our little baby dinos, who are definitely going to need some attention. Let's jump in and take care of the belugas. Oh, dolphin 27 just gave birth. Very exciting. Hello, Belugas. Guests are starving. Okay, that's a major issue. We've got to solve that. Why are guests starving? That, that's just, that's not acceptable. Where are our starving guests? I thought we had enough places for everybody to eat. All right, intern, quick, do some surveys. Whoa. All right, so she is definitely starving. She's also very cranky put her next to the restaurant. So she came from over here. So like I was thinking, over here might be a good spot to put in uh, some drinking and eating places. Let's see. And where were some of the other starving guests? Need to throw this trash away. So she can eat though. Time for me to go home. Too late for him. That's Gretchen. Yeah, look. Interesting. They're all over here. All right. I think that we're on to something that we should definitely consider putting in another, but should it be the generic one? I mean, everyone can get what they want from the generic one. It's just not as fun. Yeah, let's go ahead and put the generic ones in and we'll do the themed ones that are really fun when it comes time to open up our coastal area. We can do the fun things like the, the coconut seafood stuff and the really, really yummy like sugar stuff. So let's see, let's just do, should we just put it right here? Yeah, let's just go ahead and put the drink stand right here. We'll even throw a dessert stand in. We'll put the food snack stand right here. Wait, let's move the donation box. In fact, where should we put this donation box? Let's put it 
over here for now. There we go. And then let's go ahead and feed the guests over in this area. Also, I took out, no, the bathroom's right there. That's right, okay, we'll be okay. There's this huge area for them to come and tour. Hmm. All right, where are we? We need to feed our guests the desserts. There we go. So that should take care of everybody. Everybody should be happy after that. There's desserts, there's food. Yeah, food, desserts, and drink all lined up. I kinda wanna space it out a little better though. Can't really, not really possible though. Ah, uh, I guess that's okay. There we go. Take those out. Then let's dress it up with it. Whoops, I didn't mean to move you. Ignore me, tree fern. I don't want you to be moved. All right, let's pull you out a little bit so you don't go through the tank wall. Put you there. Put you there. You're going through the tank wall. That's not allowed, tree fern. I love my trees, but they're not allowed to wreck. Well, drat. Okay, it should be okay. Not allowed to wreck the safety and integrity of the things that we keep our animals in. Whoa, giant tree. Java fern, java fern. And let's grab some little jungle lilies. Jungle lilies, jungle lilies, jungle lilies, jungle lilies. And you know what? I kind of want to put that marine statue right here. Because why not? Oh yeah, we need places for guests to be able to sit and eat and then to throw their stuff away. So let's go ahead, put those in here. And where'd our little trash cans go? Oh, there they are. Let's see. Underwater trash can, paradise trash can. That's pretty funny. I think we'll just go, yeah, with this trash can. That's what we want. Let's make sure that there's a trash can. Let's make sure that there's a recycling can. And hopefully that'll take care of our guests. Hopefully people can start going all over there if they are hungry and they'll find adequate nutrition. And let's go ahead and start replacing some of this sand out. Wow, that just looks so much more professional. I like it, intern, I like it. Gentlemen, look at him go. He's headed for a drink. I approve, sir. All right, we're almost done, intern. We've done a lot. The new little guys have been added. I know this has been more of a, a difficult day for us because we've been busy, busy bees. Look at that. Look at that weird statue. Look at that marine statue. Interesting. Let's let's put it let's put it in another direction. Let's see. It appears to be sea otters. Oh, that's adorable. Oh, there we go. I like that. I like that a lot. Then let's see. Let's finish this up with just a little bit, a little bit of final touches. Let's see. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Nope, too big. So we're gonna keep this nice and condensed. Can I get any flowers in here? <gasps> I can! Look, we can stick some tulips in there. Or a medium bed of yellow flowers that's kind of overgrown or purple. Oh, hey, boom. And there we go. Perfect size. Where are you going? Oh, donating money. Thank you, Britta. And you know what I think we're missing over here now? Other than the really cool like little awning that we were going to do. All right, and he's going to the trash can. That's exactly what we need. We need, how's everybody doing over here? Everybody looks a lot happier over here. Yeah, everyone needed fed. We need this guy. Marine gift cart number five. You can come hang out right in front of our awesome statue. Boom. It's all starting to come together. Oh, that looks excellent in turn. Good job. Oh. Well, that was quite a bit of work for today. I know it was more the technical stuff and a little bit of researching to make sure that our guests have everything they need. But I'm quite pleased with how things are starting to turn out. Except this ma'am, this madame is not. There you go, ma'am. Need a little help getting to the bathroom in time. Oh, 
And look, the green sea turtle's gonna lay an egg! Aw, that's- oh, and the beluga gave birth! That's always a fun thing to, to leave the day off with, though. Let's see if we can watch her lay an egg. Hi, pretty girl! Well, that was a weird noise! That was a weird noise, too! Oh, yeah? You're gonna lay some eggs? I'm sorry that I shifted up the ground and stuff over here. It was so that I could make those little underwater viewing areas. Am I too close? Okay, I'm gonna come back here. Hmm, I think she's still thinking about it. It does take turtles a little while. Well, I'm gonna stay here and monitor her while she works on- Oh, 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 I think she's ready. I think she's ready. The miracle of birth all over again, intern. Isn't it so great that we work here and we can see it almost on a daily basis? Are you- are you gonna- are you gonna lay your eggs? Are you, are you thinking about it? What's she doing? Is she getting back in the water? No, she's- Oh! Green Sea Turtle 181, you're a boy! What were you doing making me think that you were gonna lay an egg? Jeez Louise. That's embarrassing. Get your butt back in the water, sir. Making cranky pants noises at me. She is the one who's gonna lay the egg. That makes so much more sense. This is a popular egg laying spot too, I've noticed. They like to climb right out and then come right here and lay their egg. Are you gonna lay your eggs? Her back flippers are moving. And, and... <gasps> We've got donations for these babies already. Can I see? Can I see your eggs? Can I see your eggs, please? Maybe? Perhaps? Man, how many eggs does she have? <gasps> there they are! Ah, oh, wonderful! Alright, I'm gonna check these new ones out and turn, and I will see you after break. Bye-bye! <laughs>